Yo, what up, people? Another R6 update today. So, uh, the test servers have been going back online today with some interesting changes. So, I'm going to start with the interesting stuff first. Uh, the deployable shield version 2 is going to be in this test server. The one that we saw, like, I think it was a year ago with these slits all in the middle. Um, it says we're sending out our first public iteration of the new deployable shield with this test server as well. There's still work to be done before they're finalized, so we'd like to collect early initial feedback from the test server and use that to test for problems and strategize around potential future iterations. Please test out new visual slits and give us your feedback. So yeah, I'll be testing them and probably do a video on my thoughts on how they can improve them, you know, the usual stuff. And the second thing is a test server charm reward. For players willing to spend extra time on the test server, uh, we will be providing a limited time charm for their uh, live PC accounts. This award will be available to players that spend at least two hours actively playing on the test server between June 26th and July 3rd. So that is today. At the end of the test period, July 3rd, we will, we will determine all eligible testers and distribute charms at a later date. So again, requirements, two hours active playtime on the PC test server must be between June 26th and July 3rd. And the charm will be given to you at some later date. So really like this change because like they did with the um, bug hunter program where everyone got the, well not everyone, but the people that solved, Jesus Christ. Uh, people that found bugs and reported them, yeah, they got a pretty cool charm. So that was a nice incentive for people to report more bugs. So this one is for everyone instead, for, you know, just helping out on the test server. And I think this is a great idea and they should do this more often. If not with charms, then maybe like a renowned booster or something like that for future test server uh, updates. And the last thing is going to be updates to exploits. Uh, we've recently completed internal testing of another potential solution to the Clash and IQ Plus deployable shield exploits. At this point, we're still unable to reproduce these exploits and as such, we're pushing these changes to the test server. To test the fix, we're asking you all to help us thoroughly test the updates, see if the exploits can still be reproduced. I don't know what these exploits are because I don't do with glitches and bugs, so I don't bother to even look them up. So if you know what clash and iq glitch they're talking about then you can go and test it out to see if you can still get it done if you can report it to the uh r6 fix website and yeah that's the end of this update video so uh just remember to play for two hours so you get a new charm i'll probably showcase that as well but yeah that's the end of the video so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one